that today actually I received two SF Express and the second item I have already done an opening video in Cantonese so everything's ripped open and it came in this uh, protective box very hard the seller told me he didn't have the original box however he gave me this pouch this is considered to be quite a big pouch and guess what have I got oh, oopsie if someone sees the string would he be able to tell this is a yo-yo yes this is a yo-yo I've got it has the stamp Tiffany and company nine to five sterling I've got this for a very good price. It's only $125 US dollars. Um, I know some some eBay sellers uh, are selling this for like $1,000 or some better deals would be like 600 US dollars, 700 US dollars, 800 US dollars. But this is not what you see every day. And I paid a very, very good price. I paid 125 US dollars. However, this might not be perfect in many collectors' eyes because it's got a name engraved on it. It's gifted to Jacqueline, was it in the year of 89? If this is the case, then is that the clue that this yo yo? is like 26 or uh, 24 years old i have no idea you know sometimes how hard it is to tell which year some tiffany product is made so if you're lucky enough to to see the details the seller provides in the list in the listing then you're lucky or else people just put yo yo tiffany finest and the price that's it despite this Jacqueline 98 engraved on it. I still think this is a very good deal. Honestly speaking, I'm not, I don't think I will pay $1,000 for mint condition yo yo. I'm a casual collector, so whatever is a good deal, I just have zero resistance to it. So this is my yo yo. I'm so happy to have it in my collection. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.